Good evening, folks. Uh, this is a West Cork Irish accent you're listening to, but hopefully you'll cope. Um, I'm just very, very happy to be here with all of you for remembering and honouring Courtney. And uh, I had the joy of being in a cell with him, as, he's, as Mark said, at Catholic U for a number of years. I uh, taught there from 78 to 84, and uh, most of that time uh, he and I shared an office together, and uh, we were like the uh, twin pyramids of papers. Uh, you could hardly see each other with all the mounds of papers between the two of us. And of course, um, uh, we are bo both competing for the, uh, the attentions of the students of various kinds. So uh, the, the room was so small that only one student at a time could come in and have a conversation with either one of us. And so we had a, a rather cozy relationship in there uh, over those years that we were together. And uh, the School of Social Work at Catholic U uh, recognized Courtney's passion for social justice and, uh, and uh, when they decided that they were going to start an institute on social justice, uh, they decided that Courtney was the one to lead the institution uh, for us. And so I think that was just not just a kind of a thing that he was into, it was a thing that he was rec recognized for his leadership in and his commitment to by his fellow faculty at Catholic U. And a number of them were talking to me and told me they wanted me to uh, to send their best wishes and congratulations to all of you for joining together to honour and remember the, the good work and the many commitments uh, that Courtney has made to the needs of people who needed help in various and sundry ways.